Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, my name is Mackenzie. Make sure to hit the subscribe button and stick around. I would love to have you guys join the fun. Today I am back with another bathing suit haul. These are some of my most requested videos and you guys have been dying to see one from Romwe. So that's what I've got for you today. All of these suits are under $20 when you use my coupon code to save. As per usual, I will leave links, coupon code, sizing, all that information down below in the description bar. So make sure to check that out. And without further ado, let's hop right on it. All right, starting off with this pink floral swimsuit to start. This is one of my favorite top styles for laying out. However, it's not super functional for swimming. So if you're looking for a suit to really be active in the water in, I would say skip out on this one. It does have a little bit of underwire throughout. However, the cups are pretty short in height, so they don't have all that much coverage to them. They have thin adjustable straps, and then this back has a silver clasp, which you're going to see a lot throughout this try-on haul. One of my favorite styles to tan in, like I said, because it does have a super simple um, fit to it but you know not super practical if you're looking to dive under waves and stuff like that as for the bottoms these are some of my favorite style bottoms they have a very basic tan line about a one inch throughout the front they sit very high up on the hips and really elongate those legs they're pretty cheeky along the back but they're not super crazy like you could wear these around your family and still get away with it overall just a very basic tan line it looks good on so many different body shapes this next swimsuit is very similar in style to the last it's got the exact same style top like like I said, one of my favorites to just lay out in. I really love this color palette. It's like a mix of orange, yellow, and blue, so very, very cute. It does have that same clasp along the back, and these all have removable pads to it. As for sizing, I am wearing an extra small or a small in all of these swimsuits. If the extra small is the small size they have, I'm wearing the extra small. If they don't offer it and the sizing starts at a small, then I'm wearing the small. I'm about a 25 inch waist, 34B in the chest. I will leave my measurements down below. These bottoms are basically the same as the last one the only difference is that these are not a raw hem so if you see this last bathing suit it is lined with the same material front and back and it's got a raw hem so this is going to fit very similar to seamless underwear whereas this bathing suit as you can see has a white lining and you can see that floral stitched around the sides this is going to fit very similar to your hipster underwear that has a little bit more of a seam to it still rather cheeky and then this one actually does come with a little sarong to tie around the waist this is waterproof as well so if you want to wear this into the water you can you guys know the drill by now this is the exact same style top like I said I am a really big fan of this style this one's got a little bit of white pink yellow green and blue throughout so very cute top and then the bottoms are just pretty much the exact same thing they've got that standard hipster back you can see that these ones have a little bit more coverage I will say that when a bottom is not self tying um, they do run a little bit snugger so if you're in between sizes and you're looking for a suit with this style bottom go up this next suit has a little bit of underwire throughout the top as well however this one definitely has more coverage than the last one for starters this has thick adjustable straps it does still have that silver clasp along the back but as you can see the cups to this just have a lot more coverage they're definitely taller and they're really gonna hold your boobs in place so if you have a larger chest I would definitely recommend a style swimsuit like this they tend to have a little bit more support they don't move around all that much as for the bottoms these are basically your standard hipster bottoms you're gonna see a lot of these throughout this haul um, for me this is my favorite style to wear around my family and I do have a family vacation on the horizon which is why I picked up a bunch of styles that could work for that I know a lot of you guys are interested in a little bit more coverage down there as well so this one is a pretty safe option same like one inch throughout they are a little bit cheeky in the back but nothing super crazy I would say that this is pretty moderate coverage for their suits hands down my favorite style suit to wear is a string bathing suit top like your typical triangle top and then standard bottom Bottoms. So I got a couple of them. This top is one of my favorites. This is probably my favorite bathing suit of this haul. It's a mix of pink and yellow, kind of like a tropical Hawaiian floral. You can self-tie these around the neck and then self-tie them around the bottom as well. I always recommend a knot and then a bow just in case your bow comes undone. You still have a backup plan. It's not like your top's going to be floating around in the water. These give a very basic tan line. They make your boobs look extra perky and yet you can still swim in them without having too much like moving around. The bottom 
bottoms are the same that I've been showing you. These do not have a raw cut. As you can see, these ones do have that seam throughout. They're a little bit thinner along the sides, sit very high up along the hips, and just really slim down your figure. I feel like these are so flattering. I'm on the shorter side. I'm only 5'2", 5'3"-ish, and I feel like these really do a lot for me. They really do make me look taller than I am, so two thumbs up Next there. suit I grabbed is essentially the exact same style. These bottoms are a little bit fuller in coverage, but not by much. The bottoms are like an orange, and they've got a mix of like teal and blue floral throughout that same kind of Hawaiian-esque print. And then the top is the exact same style. You've got that string bathing suit. These cups move along this lower band, so you can cinch them up to be a little bit smaller, or you can spread them apart. Um, I do want to put this up next to my hand so you can kind of see for reference how big these cups are. They're still not the biggest cups in the world, so even when they're fully spread, it's not like you're getting the most supportive top, but... I still think they're adorable. Alright, next suit is the same triangle style top. This one is blue with a little bit of orange and pink floral. I love anything that's like this tropical print. I see them all over my Instagram Explore page. A lot of designer swimsuits have been rolling out these prints as well, and so Romwe and Shein have been coming out with more affordable options. Pads are removable on this, and then this one actually has string bottoms. I'm not as much of a fan of string bottoms just because I feel like they have a little less coverage all around. They they tend to be a little bit cheekier and the crotch tends to be a little bit thinner. I still like them from time to time. I think they're very flattering. They look great in photos, but like I said, you know, not usually my go-to. Um, I always recommend, again, tying these in a knot and then in a bow just in case. Next suit I have is a neon color blocked moment and I love this. It's neon pink throughout the cups with a little bit of blue and orange throughout. Anything color blocked I really love. This is a great option if you are wanting to wear a triangle style suit, but maybe your boobs are too big for a string style you think they're gonna move around that's not enough support for you this is a triangle style cup but these are stitched into place so these cups don't move along that lower band don't run the risk of these sliding around while you're in the water or things like that so definitely a safer option these have thicker adjustable straps and then they do have a silver clasp along the back as for the bottoms, they are that same ribbed material, but these are actually lined with this like white mesh, which I'm not a huge fan of. I feel like this makes suits feel and look a lot cheaper, just because when the fabric rolls, you can see the white peeking out. So I'm not as much of a fan of that. You definitely get what you pay for when it comes to that kind of quality. But I did like this style bottom. They dip down a little bit further in the front to give you more of a V, so they make your torso look a little bit longer. And then they've got that same cheeky coverage along the back. I really wanted to love this. This next suit I think the print is super cute it's white with a little bit of like rainbow floral throughout I have very high hopes for this but unfortunately the sizing was just a little off I got this in a size small and it just ran a little big in circumference for the top and the bottoms which is kind of a bummer because I felt like these had a really good amount of coverage to them but just a little too big on me same goes for the top if it weren't for this little string tying around the neck um, this would definitely be falling off of me since it is strapless but cute just runs large. Honestly, I wasn't 100% sure how I was going to feel about this black ribbed bikini. It looks like nothing special when you just hold it up, but it's very cute on. I felt like this was a very flattering style, and this would definitely work on several different body shapes. The bottoms just look like this. They've got a pretty moderate amount of coverage in the back, so if you're looking for something that's cheeky but nothing too crazy I would definitely recommend these especially since they are that string style I feel like that's hard to come by and then the top um, also a great top if you have a larger chest and you're looking for something with a little bit more support to it this does not have any clasps or self ties or hooks along the back it's just like a standard kind of like a bralette sports bra type of fit however it does self tie along the center you can kind of cinch this up a very very cute style it's got thin adjustable straps, but it's got a lot of coverage along the side boob area, so everything's going to stay in place. You're not going to have a lot of movement throughout. As long as you double knot that, you should be safe for a day of tanning and sweating. I'm a sucker for orange in the summertime. If you follow my channel, you know that. I love, love, love orange bathing suits, and this one is super unique. I don't have anything like this. Um, it is a ribbed material, like kind of almost like a towel, as you can see, and it's got like a caged back to it. So it's got a couple of different lines throughout, and these adjustable straps that move along 
along the back. If you are planning on diving under waves and being tossed around and playing water games, I wouldn't necessarily recommend this. These straps actually can be removed back here so that you can crisscross it, but because of that, I don't feel like it's the safest water suit. Still very cute though, gonna make a cute photo and definitely good for laying out. The bottoms just look like this. They've got about the same amount of coverage in the front as they do in the back, so definitely a cheekier, skimpier style. But they've got that little silver ring along the front, which I love. And the next swimsuit is something very different for me. Um, I'm not usually a fan of this style, but I wanted to give this a try. I think that the color palette is super fun. It's a warm mix of orange, pink, and yellow, and it has that halter style. So this crisscrosses along the neck, and these cups kind of fit like this. These swimsuits are really nice because you can tie them a bunch of different ways. I could wear this as a triangle style if I wanted. You can wrap the straps around your like torso. You can wrap them around the neck. Kind of can do whatever with this. So definitely a versatile top if you're looking for like a swimsuit where you can mix and match and get more bang for your buck. I definitely recommend something like this. And then the bottoms just look like this. They are a little bit thinner than some of the other ones. They're only single lined in the back. They are double lined in the front with that white mesh. And they've got just that standard amount of coverage along the back. Of course, these do self tie along the back. So you do have a little bit more of that low rise tan line and the sides of you on display. As for the bottoms, the little three piece set is actually not a sarong. These are like mesh beach pants. I love these. Um, I only have like one pair of these. I think they're super fun to wear. You could even mix and match this with a white bathing suit to just add something fun to your look. They're more of like capris. They're not full length pants, just so you know, um, but they are mesh. So you can see the swimsuit, which I think is super cute to cover I picked up. up this pink ribbed bathing suit because I was like, you know what? I'm going to try something different. Um, this one has like these little silver hearts throughout the bottoms and along the top. It tied in a really unique way. And I was like, you know, I'm going to give this a try, but it wasn't a huge fan of this it felt very cheap that white mesh along the inside kind of kept peeking out of the sides and I don't feel like this was the most flattering style on me I don't know maybe I'm wrong but I just not my fave last but not least I did pick up one one piece I am a sucker for one pieces I think they are the cutest for photos if you are headed to meet your friends for coffee or lunch and you want to just slip on a pair of denim shorts over top it kind of just looks like you're wearing a bodysuit which is of course ideal this one is like a mix of purple with a little bit of light pink and orange floral throughout this print is so fun I have a swimsuit very similar in a blue and yellow that I just love and it's got a bunch of different crisscrosses along the back this is a very family friendly style if you're looking for something that has more of that standard straight across fit along the front and then a moderate coverage along the back this is going to be a safe option all right you guys that is going to be all for this short and sweet a little bathing suit haul I hope that you guys enjoyed this is actually gonna be the only try on haul that you see here in my room at home I will be moving to California very very soon so you'll be seeing a new background for bathing suit hauls coming soon uh, make sure to hit that subscribe button so you don't miss out and I will talk to you very very soon bye guys